Thursday, State Representative Mike Hill filed House Bill 235. The bill bans abortions after a heartbeat is detected in the fetus. Doctors would be required to conduct ultrasounds to determine this. My oath said that I would protect life, liberty, and the pursuit of happiness. Life being the first one. So I thought it was incumbent upon me as an elected official to protect life whenever I can. Both doctors and women could face felony charges if abortions are done after this time. If the woman is raped or learns the baby has abnormalities, the procedure still cannot be done. As horrendous and heinous a crime is as rape and incest, for some reason God decided that there's going to be life here. And who are we to say, no, you made a mistake, we're going to kill the baby anyway. Hill says the bill does have an exception if the procedure is necessary to protect the mother's life. I'm immediately pro-choice. Bridget Gibson believes this proposed legislation is a violation of women's rights. I believe women have a right to choose. And, you know, quite frankly, it's about understanding what's going on with your own body. She believes men should not make it illegal for women to make decisions about their own body. That he was a representative and he's a male, absolutely not. Others see the bill as a step in the right direction. Any society is judged by the way in which it treats its most vulnerable and its most innocent. And what could be more vulnerable or innocent than a child in the womb? I am all for um, being against abortion, I think that it's it's wrong. I think that um, a beating heart indicates that it's a life.